Good day, everyone. Today, we will be discussing solves real-life problems involving GCF and LCM of two to three given numbers. Together, let's make learning mathematics fun and easy. After going through this lesson, you are expected to solve real-life problems involving GCF, common multiple, and LCM of 2 to 3 given numbers. Learning Task 1 Determine the number if it is a multiple of another number. Seventy-two, the multiples are two, four, six, eight, nine, and twelve. Four hundred seventy-two multiples are two, four, and eight. Nine sixty are two, three, four, five, six, eight. 10, 12. 220 multiples are 2, 4, 5, 10, 11. 828, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12. Learning Task 2 Solve each problem using the application of LCM and GCF. In art class, Mrs. Lucia had 36 sheets of green paper and 42 sheets of blue paper. If Mrs. Lucia wanted to give an equal number of each type of paper, how many sheets of paper should each pupil get? We have 36 and 42. Using the multiplier by 2 or div divide, 2 divided by 36 is 18. 2 divided by 42 is 21. The prime number 3. 3 divided by 18 is 6. 3 divided by 21 is 7. 2 times 3. 2 times 3 equals 6. Therefore, each pupil should get 6 sheets of paper. Learning Task 3 Solve each problem using the application of LCM and GCF. Louise picked 40 tomatoes in the morning and 48 eggplants in the afternoon. She wants to put them equal in the plastic bags. What is the largest number of vegetables that he can put in plastic bags? 40 and 48. 40 and 40 is divisible by 2. 40 divided by 2 equals 20. 48 divided by 2 equals 24. 20 and 24 is divisible by 2. 20 divided by 2 equals to 10. 24 divided by 2 is equals to 12. 10 and 12 is divisible of 2. 2 divided by 10 is equals to 5. And 2 divided by 12 is equals to 6. Our prime factors are 2. 2 times 2 times 2 equals to 8. Therefore, the largest number of vegetables is 8. Learning Task Apply the LCM and GCF in solving the word problems below. Mary has two pieces of cloth. One piece is 72 inches wide and the other piece is 90 inches wide. She wants to cut both pieces into strips of equal width that are as wide as possible. How wide she sh should she cut the strips? 72 and 90 is divisible of 2. 
2 divided by 72 is 36. 2 divided by 90 is 45. This is divisible by 3. 36 divided by 3 is 12. 45 divided by 3 is equals to 15. This is divisible also by 3. 3 divided by 12 is equals to 4. 3 divided by 15 is equals to 5. Two times three times three equals to eighteen. Therefore, we should cut the strips eighteen inches wide. Jerwin exercises every twelve days at end Nikki every eight days. Jerwin and Nikki both exercise today. How many days will be until they exercise together again? We have 12 and 8 is divisible by 2. 2 divided by 12 is equal to 6. 2 divided by 8 is equal to 4. This is divisible by 2. 2 divided by 6 is equal to 3. 2 divided by 4 is equal to 2. Two times two times three times two equals to twenty-four. Therefore, it will be twenty-four days until the exercise together again. Sian has eight inch pieces of toy train shock and Ruth has eighteen inch pieces of train shock. How many of each piece would each child need to build trucks? that are equal in length. We have 8 and 18 are divisible to 2. 2 divided by 8 is equals to 4. 2 divided by 18 is equals to 9. Two times four times nine equals to seventy-two. Number of small trucks seventy-two divided by eight divided by equals nine. Number of big trucks seventy-two divided by eighteen equals to four. Therefore, Sia needs nine smaller trucks and four bigger trucks. Thank you for watching. Till our next mathematics lesson. Goodbye.